Yo, what's good, you guys? It's your boy Zilla Jackson back at it again with another video. Let's go. And yeah, so yesterday, I ain't gonna lie to you, I was kind of OD. OD with the whole Aiden Ross and all of that. But, you know, I was not wrong at all whatsoever. I still think it's weird that he did that. And, you know, even though I was OD, right? I just saw this right now, and it's a video by Internet Anarchist. I hope I said that correctly. And it's literally talk about how Aiden Ross is destroying his career. So, with all that said, make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, follow me on all my socials. That means my personal, my gaming, Instagram, and TikTok. And let me know if y'all want me to show my Twitter, because I don't really, I don't really be on Twitter anymore either. Like that, not like that, but let's get right into it. I'm not even gonna waste time. I'm not even gonna waste time, bro. Oh shoot, let me use, let me use that one. Over the past few days, Aiden Ross has earned himself the title of the Evil Mr. Beast. He did this by hosting a series of controversial streams where he would pay his viewers to fulfill extreme challenges. Aiden Ross is a streamer who has gained- Honestly, I hope that this does not get either copyright or it doesn't get taken down again. Because the last time I, I reacted to one of these dude's videos, it just got taken down instantly a large following through his entertaining streams. Whether he had Lil Uzi Vert on stream freestyling or was just playing NBA 2K with friends, millions of people would consistently tune in to Aiden's streams. After meeting Andrew Tate, Aiden Ross promised to try and become a good role model for his young and impressionable audience. Although he would begin with what was seen as a strong start by working out more, promoting self-care, and calling out adult content on Twitch, the f Okay, you know, that makes sense, right? You know? Yeah, be a role model, because that's literally what you are being paid to do, really. Anybody that's that's being elevated into that status, Twitch streamer, YouTuber, uh, TikToker, you're more than just an influencer, you know that, right? You're at that point that you're a role model. You're literally a role model to millions of people, thousands, thousands, hundreds of people role model you're a role model but you yeah let's let's get to you the facade would soon crumble with more recent streams showing a much darker side of aiden ross a side that contradicts the previous efforts he was trying to make and morals he was trying to uphold hi i'm the internet anarchist i create weekly youtube documentaries and today we'll be looking into the extremely controversial challenge streams hosted by aiden ross on the 24th of february 2023 aiden ross would post a video to youtube announcing that he would begin streaming on a new site called kick kick was a site that was created by co-founder of gambling site stake after twitch announced the banning of live gambling streams. In the final days of February, Aiden would sign a multi-million dollar deal to stream on Kick and promote their platform. Twitch is notorious for having strict terms of service and often not siding with creators when it comes to issues with content. So the move to Kick would make Aiden feel incredibly free. And right off the bat, it seems this so-called freedom got to his head, as one of the first things that Aiden Ross did on Kick was stream to his young audience. After a lengthy display See, this is what I was talking about. This is this is what like what rubbed me the wrong way and what he got exposed exposed for. Never been on kick. I just saw the clips of somebody else reacting to what happened, right? That's weird. You have young kids in there too. There's young kids that you are their favorite streamer. You're weird for that, bro. Play of porn to his audience, he asked them all in chat to type how old they were. And with the floods of 11s, 13s, and 15s coming through, Aiden immediately realized he had made a fatal mistake. Chat, do y'all still beat your meat, yes or no? Wait, how old are you guys in the chat, bro? Jesus. Okay. I didn't know that. Um, yeah. All right, what episode do y'all want to watch? F Even if you didn't know what the age was, why would you do that? In a public setting. When you go live, you're public. When you're live, you're public. Just like when you post a video, you're public. You're showing everybody what you are, what are you doing, why are you doing this, literally. 
You did that to yourself at that point, bro. You're weird. Following this incident, whether related or not, Aiden Ross would be permanently banned from Twitch. For Aiden, this just meant that he lost his primary audience of over 7 million followers in a Fucking single idiot. day. And it's at this point of the story that Aiden really began to spiral. On the 2nd of March, Aiden would host a stream that would cause outrage. Hold on. Any point from right from before March? Anything before March? I knew about, but anything after March, I didn't know about. So you might not get a lot of uh, reaction from me. And I am eating a cake that I just baked right now. And it just tastes like, how do you say it? Cinnamon oatmeal. It tastes just like cinnamon oatmeal right now. And I am struggling. And I'm about to throw it out. I'm about to throw it away. <laughs> Rage. The stream would involve Aiden Ross and his friends bringing viewers onto the stream, who would be asked to enact challenges for money prizes. And what initially seemed to be relatively harmless would soon grow into a moral nightmare. The first viewer to join the stream was attending during his work at the NBA and was challenged to run onto the court. The viewer would do so, where he'd be promptly chased down by security and fired from his job. Yo! I don't give a fuck. Yo. I wonder if getting fired. Like, I wonder if that was worth it. Your 15 seconds of fame, your 15 minutes of fame was actually worth getting fired, bro. Skip a little bit. Relatively harmless and only the participant being involved, no one was prepared for what would happen next. The next participating viewer who joined the stream was home alone with his sleeping sister, who Aiden decided he should peel over and smash her TV. When preparing for the sick challenge, Aiden would receive several messages from higher ups at Kick telling him that he should stop. So instead of making his viewer peel over his sleeping sister and smash her TV, they came up with the great idea of pouring a mixture of it's crazy that even the own the own streaming service is telling you to stop, bro. The the streaming service is telling you to stop. The, right after this, I got another video that's about to, that I'm about to publish too. That was gonna be like a double upload, right? So there's one about the potential of kick and will it be a competitor against Twitch and YouTube and all these other streaming platforms like TikTok, right? Or, I mean, and then there's this, right? I do believe in Kick, bro. I do believe in Kick. The only thing is that Kick needs to update its term of service. Aiden Ross should have been perma banned for that, bro. He should have definitely been perma banned after that, bro. That's just me. That's just that's just me. Coming from a person that is in the community, in the community that look up to other people. I I you wanna tell me you wanna me tell who you I look up to, right? I look up to I'm Dante, your rage, and I look up to the whole A and P roster as a whole. That's that's what I grew up on. Those are the people I grew up on. Just like I grew up on Corey Kenshin and uh and a couple of other big name YouTubers that you see nowadays. Aiden, Aiden, it was cool when he, again, that's what I said last time. It was cool when he was introducing new rappers and rappers into his streams and letting them listen, I mean, letting them hear some of the music, interviewing them, right? It was like, you know, we're gonna get to, get to know this rapper for who he really is. I think the only person that didn't get the recognition was Blueface. And then Kai Snatch tried to do the same thing, but Blueface again destroyed destroyed what he had, right? It's like, dude, 
you at first you're being bullied right you were getting bullied into some bs right everybody tell you stop being stop being a bitch basically right then you stop right and then you go into this little rebellious phase right start doing random stuff you start you start you switch over to another streaming service and you do this type of stuff bro that's that's what i don't like bro that's what i don't like i mean <laughs> you can miss me with that you can miss me with that spit BS. expired beer coffee creamer mustard and tomato sauce all over her as well as smashing her tv the viewer would ask his neighbor to come over and film the cruel prank live to aiden's seventy thousand viewer audience you're gonna pull the blanket off her pour all on her face listen I wonder if those 15 seconds of fame was worth it, bro. You are one of those people that should not be on the internet. You are one of those people that should not be on the internet. Like, bro, what are you doing, bro? I understand if you're profiting off of it, you know, pranking. But usually, the pranks usually consist of them replacing Zed TV. I don't even think this dude replaced the TV after that, bro. And then these are white sheets with the green substance that might not come out what are you doing what are you doing no yo. go back to the room now nah, go back to the room yo Katie. here Katie. don't spit on her bro fuck it go back in the room katie stop 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 she hit me with the bat oh. she hit the bat she hit me with the bat no. she hit me. <laughs> Dude, she's chasing me with a fucking bat. The unsuspecting sister who had no idea what was going on would then go into her brother's room to smash his TV before calling her family to talk about what just happened to her. But if you thought this was bad, things were only going to get worse as the next few. Oh my gosh. I swear, like every video, I'm dropping my mic onto my plate or onto my desk or something. I need to move this out of the way. But like, bro, how can it get worse? We're five minutes into this video, bro. How, how, how much has this man done where he's just this bad, bro? Oh my gosh to participate in the stream was a younger looking man who was home with his grandmother and brother. At first the viewer was going to pour flour all over his sleeping grandmother, but after some thought Aiden realized it could literally kill her. So instead of pouring flour all over his grandmother, he was instead challenged to pee on his brother's face. But after Aiden found out the viewer's brother was a fan of Hassan Pika, he would say this. I wanna go pee in the face, okay? Okay. Alright, I gotta hide this shot. I gotta hide this shot. No, no, listen, he's a something? Bro, if you slit his throat, I think I'll give you 20k. No, I'm, kidding, I'm, kidding, I'm, kidding, I'm 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 kidding. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I gotta get everything ready, I gotta get everything ready. The participant would pee in a cup on stream, and right as the challenge was about to go down, the viewer's connection would drop, leaving Aiden feeling quote, blue balled. But this would lead into the next challenge, which was once again more twisted than the last. The next viewer to participate in the stream was asked to eat fresh dog feces, but after Aiden found out the participant's girlfriend was home sleeping, it was his girlfriend who quickly became the target for the prank, as Aiden would ask the viewer to cover her in dog excrement. It was also at this point that Aiden would ask participant to call him back after he'd found a quote nice wet fresh piece of dog sh following this aiden would resort to streaming slots
no need to get slapped in your freaking face, bro. You need to just like jail. You need jail, bro. Like, there's no saving you at this point, bro. I mean, I mean, look, 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 look. Me as other people are playing devil's advocate. But you are not even making a case for yourself, bro. Bro, you're fucking OD, Roast. Fucking, oh my gosh, bro. Oh my gosh, bro. And we actually made this dude famous. We actually made this dude famous, bro. You got... You got a little bit more clout. You switch to another service where you can be a little bit more free. And you go and do this shit, bro. I really want to fucking bash my head in at this point, bro. Like, literally, literally, I want to break my arm again. I want to break my arm again. Just listening to this, bro. Like, at this point, I do. <laughs> bro. Bro. And this would be the point where I would make a tweet sharing a clip from Aiden's stream. The clip I posted would gain over 5 million views, as well as the attention of Aiden Ross himself, as he had reached out in a DM to me saying, quote, I'm gonna keep doing it every day. It's gonna keep getting more extreme. When I start giving out hundreds of thousands, I expect you to post that too. Although the conversation continued, for privacy reasons, I won't be sharing it. But Aiden wasn't joking about doing it every day and making it more extreme, as he would host yet another challenge stream and during this stream, one of the participants would be given the challenge of pepper spraying themselves, shaving their head, and drinking hot sauce for twenty thousand dollars. Yo. Yo. God damn. Yo. <laughs> Yo. 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 There seems to be two sides to the controversy. On one hand, he is giving life-changing amounts of money to his viewers. But on the other, he is also a multi-millionaire who has demonstrated in the past that he has no concept of money for the average person. As seen in this clip when he thinks the average salary in the US is 100k. Okay, so the average salary is what, like $100,000? Hell no. What? What's Did you just hear this motherfucker? What's the average salary? Bro, shut the fuck up. Are you fucking crazy? What's the average salary of a human being? Bro, 30, 40K, bro. Are this thing What? Crazy. Wait, it's really 40K? Bro, bro, that's what I say. Ain't it, bro? See, that's what I say. You come from two. Well, I ain't gonna say what you came from. With Aiden planning on doing this every day and getting more and more extreme, it seems like it's only a matter of time before someone gets critically injured or worse. Okay, bro. Oh my gosh, that was a that was a lot, bro. That was a lot. That was a lot right there, bro. That was a lot, and I. But uh, I thought I was OD last video, right? I really did think I was OD. I was just on that on that dude's nuts, bro. I thought I was on his nuts, right? But this literally proves me correct. I I literally don't know at this point, bro. That's crazy. All right. So with that said and done, stop making stupid people famous. Uh, words words to die for. Uh. Yeah, I'll catch you guys again. Hopefully tomorrow. But with that said, it's been your boy Zoe Jackson. Peace, bro. Y'all have a...
great rest of your days and even a better tomorrow <laughs> of that uh, and i'll catch y'all later deuces